me, folks. My words, my opinion. Hey. All right, look. It's no secret that I, in my entire life, I never really cared who was going to be president, Republican, Democrat. Why? Because they were the same. All right. And sides. You know, the other thing is the Democrats would win, then the Republicans win. So it would offset it, it would balance out any political changes or any type of policies. OK, so it always balanced out having, you know, because if, if you will look at it, Republicans win and Democrats win, and the Republicans win. It goes back and forth. But. Yeah, I'm not a Trump supporter. I'm not a never, never Trumper. <laughs> I've never been a never, never Trumper. All right. It's just the fact when I see a man, a president attempt to overthrow our country. Yeah, that's when I lose support for him. But it just amazes me. You see the right. They're out there screaming, hoo hoo, Trump's ripping it up. He's winning. Yeah, it's the Republican nomination. It's not <laughs> it's not the, it's not the general election. OK, and a lot of these Republican states, what are they doing? They're not even having votes. They're having caucuses. Why? Here in Utah, they're having caucuses. Why? Because they don't want to show the real numbers. They don't want people to really know what's going on. So what we have here in Idaho, 93% of the Republican voters didn't come out. Why? Well, who are you picking? You got Nikki or you got Donnie Trump, you know? 93% didn't bother to go to the caucus. Okay? What other states are like that? Okay. Uh, they're caucusing here in Utah. I'm not going to bother. All right? If, if they want to put Trump in as a nomination, that's fine. But I guarantee you this. I will bet. Can't bet all of you. But I did pick up. Somebody said they'd bet me that Trump won, and I I picked it up for fifty bucks. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know how to find him, to pay him, or to to get my fifty bucks if I lose. But I, if Trump is on the ballot, which again I don't think Biden will be there. Maybe he's going to drop and let Harris take over. Who knows? But I don't think Trump is going to be there. All right, and. I just think that they're screaming and whooping and hollering. And yeah, he's ripping up the primaries and the caucuses. And yeah, they're trying to build momentum. They're trying to create a fire for Trump. But once the, I don't care who the Democrats put out there. All right, they could be a dog. And I have bet $50. <laughs> that Trump will lose no matter who runs against him if he is on the ballot come November, all right? But it's, it's just hilarious. I mean, I didn't check the other states, but 93% in Idaho didn't even bother. That doesn't mean it's because they assume Trump's going to win. It's because they may not be voting for Trump at all, all right? We had in Arizona, Republican controlled, but Biden won that state. So I, like I say, we don't have to worry yet. Not until SCOTUS comes back to rule on immunity. That's the big question. But today's ruling wasn't a big shock either, folks, because it actually says in the 14th Amendment, Section 5, Congress decides. So that's why Colorado doesn't have the ability to keep people off the ballot. The recourse well, that would be to send their representatives or their senators to Congress to initiate removal of Trump from the ballots. It has to be in Congress. My words, my opinion. Subscribe, like, ring the bell. Have a good day, folks. Put a smile on someone's face. It is not that hard. Good joke, bad joke.